Hello, this is Tofman Trifo Productions with another Blender quick tip. And in this quick tip, I'm going to show you how you can pivot around your model in Blender. Um, usually in a 3D package, once you select part of your model, like we've done here, it will automatically pivot around the model when you use your uh, middle mouse, hold down your middle mouse button and you move your mouse around. Uh, Blender isn't one of those packages, but there's an easy fix for that. Once you select any part of your model, shirt or pants, whatever part you want to select, go to view and then frame select it and automatically zooms into that part of the model that you have selected. And then it pivots around it, which makes it easier to work on uh, that part of the model. And it doesn't only work in object mode, it works in edit mode also. So with our shirt selected, let's press tab on the keyboard, go to edit mode. I'm going to have to kind of move our viewport here. And if we click on any part of our model, let's click on, let's say that part of it, then go back up to view and frame selected again, it'll zoom into that part we just highlighted or selected. And then even with that part selected, the cool thing about this is once that part is still selected and it stays selected, we go back into edit mode by pressing tab. If we pull ourselves back into uh, the front view of our model here. Let's say you have a really big scene. You have you've kept that part of your model selected, and then you press tab to go to go into edit mode again. Sometimes Blender does this; it'll freeze up, it'll lag. But let's give it a second. There we go. And then your that part of the model that you've just selected when you've put it in edit mode has just kind of disappeared. You go to view again, frame select it. It'll take you right back to where your model is. So yeah, that's a pretty nifty tool that Blender has. Sometimes you would wish that the, that, that was automatic, but it isn't, but it's, it's all good. Uh, but yeah, that's the, today's Blender quick tip, how to pivot around a selection in Blender the easy way. And uh, once again, I hope this was helpful for those of you who have watched. Uh, thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. All right, adios.